You're the author of three books dealing with Jewish life in America. Why did you want to write about Jewish immigrant life in the U.S.? The reason I wanted to write about the book, The Olive Tree, and that's the first one I wrote, was for the very fact that we cater so much, and I'm saying this not out of disrespect in any way, I cherish the people who survived the Holocaust. I truly cherish them. And it's such a blessing from heaven that they come and they lecture and they have lived to do that. Because I think in my growing up years, nobody talked about the Holocaust. The survivors didn't even discuss it. It was uh, something they wanted to put out of their minds. But we're so blessed that in these past decades, they have talked about it, lectured about it, and this is great. But I feel in all respect to that, there's a definite need to talk about life as it was, especially in my family. When my parents and all of our families came to this country and the upbringings that we all had, and in my case, how wonderful life was for us, that we're so blessed to have that. And I think we should talk about that more. And I always say when I am lecturing with my books that mine was a happy life from beginning, hopefully to the end with a few mishaps in between. But I want people to know about that. So I feel it's extremely important to tell about life and how it was and in my case, growing up in Utica.